Dan Walker has revealed his face is coming on nicely just days after he was left covered in blood following a bike accident which saw him be thrown to the ground. The Channel 5 News anchor has been sharing updates with his fans after coming off his bike which left him requiring hospital treatment after sustaining nasty injuries. The 45-year-old took to social media last week to reveal he had been knocked off of his bicycle on one of Sheffield's busiest roundabouts while venturing from his home to the train station. Walker explained that he had no recollection of the incident but woke up to paramedics treating him at the scene before revealing his helmet saved his life. In view of his 796,000 Twitter followers, he shared a snap alongside his dog Winnie alongside the caption, took Winnie for a walk and a haircut today. She's much happier than she looks and smells gorgeous. Face coming on nicely. Hopefully back in business soon. Thanks for all your lovely messages. His post was soon met with messages of support from fans and celebrity pals with Sally Biddle responding, You look so much better Dan. So good to see. Good to see you are recovering Dan, said one fan. Before a second typed, Your face is healing up really well. You are both looking a lot better keep recovering you are the best news journalist so are missed, gushed another. Meanwhile, a fourth commented, you're looking much better mate, and Winnie looks amazing too. Hope you're doing okay? Stay strong, keep recovering and take it easy. Dan recently reached out to the driver of the car which struck him on the roundabout connecting Eccles All Road, Sheffield and St. Mary's Road with the city centre. Writing in the Sunday Times, Dan thanked the driver for staying around after the incident, before adding, I am confident that I am not to blame and hope this can be resolved outside the courts. I know I could have died, but I also know how easy it is to make a mistake, even when you're trying to be very careful. Speaking shortly after the terrifying ordeal, Dan told his followers, I think I got hit by a car but was out cold for about 20 minutes. I have no memory of it, I can't believe I haven't broken anything or that it is so much worse. I came round on the tarmac with paramedics and police standing over me. I'm very thankful to still be here and just have a beast of a headache. The news anchor was taken to a nearby hospital and was made to wait outside in a queue of ambulances before being admitted. Melting